We're all familiar with the name, from John McIntosh Square to John McIntosh Hall and more. But what's less known nowadays is the life of the man behind it, and that's what this book sets out to uncover. I would say that he, together with his wife, were a power couple, because they really did a huge amount, both in their own lives and then subsequently in the bequests that they made. John McIntosh is known for his success in the coal industry, but he branched out further into oil and gas, wines and spirits, and ship owning. The book sets out a picture of a shrewd and forward-thinking businessman. He felt very strongly about looking after uh, the coal heavers uh, because they were not employees, they were casual labour. And he felt that they, they deserved a living wage. And this was a, a very, very unusual voice to hear at a time when exploitation was normally the name of the game. Among the many results of his philanthropy, Victoria Stadium, named not after the Queen, but after Victoria McIntosh. A lot of money was spent on education. Many, many uh, persons were given grants to study in the UK from the McIntosh Educational Trust. But then you've got also Mount Alvernia and the Jewish home and the third home that was later sort of subsumed, which was the one for the Protestant community. With a lot of old records destroyed, the task of piecing together such a varied life was tough. The Gibraltar government archives uh, were helpful and uh, they brought to light a lot of things that uh, have been completely forgotten. And fortunately, uh, family of Victoria McIntosh are still alive. They, uh, particularly Nian Haynes and her brother Tom Haynes, were very, very kind. They gave me photographs and they, and they shared with me family histories and family lore. It managed to uh, produce a rounded picture of this incredibly important couple who did so much for Gibraltar. And Richard's daughter Beatrice Garcia, an artist, designed the book's cover, echoing the tile motif in the merchant's old offices in Irish town. Making a Difference, The Life and Times of John McIntosh is available from the Heritage Trust shop on John McIntosh Square.